Record the fire starter. Yep. Keep the fire warm for I will. What's all of a sudden with him backing up all that? What's that boy doing? He likes to back that thing up, I can tell you that. Oh yeah, that's exactly right. Here I come over to record the fire starter. Oh, okay. Um, Daddy. Here in 30 Daddy. seconds. What? Um, where is it? Don't do my brother. Reese said what? Don't do my brother. Done? No, dumb. Dumb? Yeah. What? 333, sending. Really crap. I, I had. No, I got it. Bullshit. Yeah. The big fire is about ready to go. We're going to get blown away before it gets started, but... Hey, you put no gas on it this time, Pat. <laughs> oh, yeah. Dry out in a hurry. Yeah, I like that. No explosion. What about the aluminum cans? Those will all blow up and hit you. Hey, don't forget that cigarette. And they go like seven yards. I've been better. Bud, you're gonna get burnt there. that fire going, bud? Okay, stop over there. Stop on the right side. Why did he... my fire chair.
Well, I haven't, since you guys have come back, I haven't seen. Um, she blinks it on. sitting here on the way home from my son's and we have a little accident ahead I've been here probably 10 15 minutes already um, I turn around and go the other way except for there's this is like the main thoroughfare through here this is route 50 US 50 uh, not too many other ways to go unless you want to go to the county roads and I'll tell you the truth I don't know them that well around here so I just soon wait here hopefully we'll be going here in a minute and uh, I, we've already seen a rollback come through with a car on the back so I uh, don't know exactly how much more there is up here but not that close so I may be back again to say something but for now I guess I'll let y'all go oh that's the time so I thought I'd put that in there too oh anyway I'll get home maybe after 11 sometime hopefully I'm not used to staying out this late I see a lot of people going in and out and around through up there so maybe we're getting ready to go I hope if so maybe I'll bring you back now well, we do have traffic moving the other way. This is the second time cars have come this way. Well, I guess we're getting ready to go too, so I guess I better go. I guess that's about that. Huh? 
let's see what else is up here. morning YouTube uh, I'm back with you again it's the next morning after I was at my son's house and uh, got a good night's rest uh, needed that rough day yesterday um, cold for one thing I think it's supposed to be up to 70 today which was which is good so uh, picked up a couple things last night or yesterday I should say first of which is a a tripod. Um, this is uh, it's one of three I got uh, given to me. Uh, the problem is this is the mount type that it uses. Let me get this a little closer. I guess they, they call these hot shoe. Uh, and I don't have anything that my camera will screw into that can be used with this. Um, I'm looking for answers on what to, to get to buy that'll screw into the bottom <clears throat> of my digital cameras so I can use these tripods. They're all the same as far as, uh, let's see, there's the other two. And they're all decent uh, tripods and they'll be be a nice addition to uh, my little flimsy one there. But, uh, like I said, they, they all have the, uh, the hot shoe and uh, connections. And so I need to, if anybody knows, what I need to buy that will screw into the bottom of my cameras. That I, I want to get three of them if I you know, can just hook them all up that way and I'll have them for each one. And Because uh, all my cameras use a screw uh, mount and they're all the same. But uh, anyway, it would be nice to use these these uh, tripods if anybody knows what to, to get that would be the thing so uh, anyway next thing I've got is I picked up is a uh, karaoke machine uh, they were gonna throw this away and I thought well you know it's one of those uh, C takes a CD and I guess you record to a cassette I've never really had a, a karaoke machine before looks like it's got a screen TV screen that uh, I guess the uh, lyrics come up on that that are synchronized with the uh, uh, CD and uh, I guess you can get those karaoke CDs online and uh, download them and then make your own the way I understand it but it looks to be a, a fairly quality unit uh, I don't know uh, like I said the uh, never had one before and I really know what to look like. I'll probably have to look the model number up on this and, and see what it is. See if I can find it on the back. Hang on a second. Alright, back. Uh, looks like the uh, Singing Machine model STVG500. Uh, I'll have to look that up I guess. But uh, has the uh, the video out in aux in and out for audio obviously. Uh, controls for brightness, contrast, and vertical hold on a TV. So, looks like I say, like I say, it's a pretty quality uh, unit. It's heavy. Um, didn't get any mics with it, but I'm sure those can be had too. Like I said, it uh, 
if nothing else, it'll be a nice project to play around with, do something, make something out of it or something. Uh, the only other thing I got was a box of soap. <laughs> uh, I, I don't think it's a classic or like a deodorant soap. I think it's like Cam A, stuff like that, but it's free. So I thought, what the heck, might as well take it. I don't know. He gets a lot of free stuff uh, off Craigslist. He's gotten a couple pool tables, a hot tub, a Coke machine. <laughs> He's just, you know, he likes to get stuff like that, and uh, several tires I think he got. But anyway, they had a yard sale yesterday and got rid of a lot of junk they didn't need, and I guess it was mostly, most of the stuff was belonged to his friend, um, and they had been storing it in their garage uh, after they moved back from Arkansas or whatever, and um, again, uh, I didn't, I don't think they made a lot of money on their yard sale, but I made a little money, and like I said, I get rid of some junk, and here I got some junk, so I guess it all evens out. But uh, anyway, I'm going to go ahead and, and uh, put this all together with uh, this footage from yesterday. And I did get some uh, some drone footage, but I didn't get anything on this this camera here. Uh, I, I couldn't film that and fly the drone at the same time. And uh, so I did take the boys... Uh, both the boy, his boys' birthdays were really recently. Uh, I think Christian, the youngest, he was Thursday. And then Bryce, I think, was the 8th of October. So, uh, anyway, I, I did get to uh, take them and get them a birthday present at the local Walmart there and uh, got that taken care of. So, um, anywho, we uh, had a good day. Like I say, we had... Uh, dinner and watched the movie, the new new, new Ghostbusters movie, he watched, uh, bought that, so, um, watched that, and, uh, had a good evening, and you've seen my, uh, when the footage I had last night, there was a wreck on the way home, um, on, the uh, US 50 between Holton and Nebraska, so, uh, I don't know that it was as serious as it, uh, looked, but, uh, I mean, as it took to clear the road, I think the, the car must have been sideways in the road is why it took so long, but uh, from the, the when we crossed where the accident was, it didn't look that serious. I, I don't think there's just one car involved, so I don't I don't know if there's any injuries or anything like that, but anywho, we did finally manage to get home at, uh, I think it was after 11 the time I got home, not real sure, but anyway, I uh, guess that's about all I have for this. You guys uh, have a great day. It's a beautiful day out there. Thanks for watching.